It is game on in the operating room. Orlando Health is the first health system here in Central Florida to use a combination of virtual reality and in-person action. Fox 35's Christy Kern got a behind the scenes look and shows us how it all works. Part virtual and part real life, but for real surgery. I could not even believe that we we're going to have this sort of technology. It's so advanced. Dr. Sean McFadden has been practicing medicine for 20 years, but this is a whole new experience. He's using it for shoulder replacements in the operating room. Hey, Blueprint, focus. Good. Dr. McFadden puts the headset on and sees a complete visual field for his patients. He pinches his fingers to adjust what he sees. I can move my my desktop anywhere. He even used me as a patient. I can place it right next to you and that way I can determine how much bone I'm going to reset. In the past, the surgery plan used to be put up in a board like this in the room, but now with the use of this new technology, it's right in front of the surgeon's eyes. It really allows us to fine tune our surgery and allows us to have all access of all the information we've acquired on that patient real time during surgery so that we can perform the patient's surgery to the best of our ability. Glenn Sharon was one of Dr. McFadden's first patients he used it on at Orlando Health Jewett Orthopedic Institute in December. He experienced shoulder pain for 10 years leading up to the surgery. It's going to help me un immensely. I mean, just psychologically, very athletic. I like to golf. You know, I like to hike and I like to do outdoor activities and it's going to help a lot. Patients don't notice a difference in surgery, but Dr. McFadden says the mixed reality makes the surgery more accurate, meaning longer term benefits for the patient. Plus, it makes for a cool experience. Big Pac-Man. This is go. really fun. Yeah. <laughs> Something I even got to try for myself. Push your finger through now. Oh my Look at that. She's a natural. She's doing better than you. <laughs> <laughs> Christy Kern, Fox 35 News. And Dr. McFadden says he started using mixed reality at Orlando Health Jewett Orthopedic Institute back in December. And that is one of only 13 sites in the country with that technology.